everyone. Cheryl M. No saying uh, hello. I'm uh, starting to come around a little now. bit. Um, you know, all the, everyone... But I have a ways to go. Maybe a day or two. I, I'd like to push myself and believe that it's not that long. But I know it is. I have to wait a little bit till I'm maybe done the antibiotic in a few days. Anyway, I wanted to come on here and say I haven't really been eating. Let me turn you around a sec. <clears throat> okay, I haven't really been eating very well when I was sick. I had absolutely no appetite. Tonight, I was starving. I think because I'm feeling better, I wanted to make myself a, a decent dinner. But something simple, a single lady meal, and that's what I'm going to call him for now on. <sighs> Say hi to Charlie. He's waiting. So I, I put out his dog food, and he's like, oh, no, I smell something better because I haven't been cooking. And I used to love to cook and bake and uh, make my homemade sauce. And maybe when I'm really well, I will do that with you someday. My aunt, she was Italian, and she taught me how to make, uh, uh, she called it gravy. I call it spaghetti sauce. So anyway, I thought I'm going to have to come on here at least to show you guys I'm making a single lady meal, a fast meal, a healthy meal. The only thing I don't have is salad because I don't have the energy to go to the store. So this is going to have to make do. And I do have some frozen veggies, but my tummy's not up for that. But I have been dying for ravioli. So I got my little table set. Let me turn you around. And I want to give you a quick... I want to, I, I'm trying to make myself feel special. So here we go. Now let's go in the kitchen and it's a mess. <laughs> I got Charlie's little plate going. But I have here some bread. I'm gonna turn off my ravioli. Uh, sliced bread, because I didn't have garlic bread. I melted some butter and then I sprinkled on some parsley. I, I don't have fresh parsley and um, some uh, garlic powder and threw it in this electric oven works fast for like seven minutes and I had my garlic bread. I am so hungry because I haven't really had anything to eat substantial for eight days. And here, this is my single lady sauce because I don't have time, I don't have the energy I have the time, trust me, to um, make my homemade gravy. So. I got a, <clears throat> I sauteed some really nice ground meat that I got at Target with my gift card from Radha. Hi, Radha. I'm getting better. And let me turn off this rear again. And um, I uh, added a jar of Prego uh, sauce. And uh, because it oh, never tastes just right for me, I added one little can of Hunt's tomato paste and I stirred it around and I added salt, pepper, parsley, and a little bit of garlic powder because I don't have any fresh garlic right now. I haven't really been shopping, shopping. So then I boiled some beautiful ravioli. I won't eat all these tonight. I'm going to give some to my neighbor. And um, of course I have my Canada Dry Black Cherry Ginger Ale. And this is for little Charlie. He's getting spoiled tonight because this dog has been so wonderful. So I will put some pictures up. I just boiled the ravioli for six minutes and they're done. And I'm all ready to go. And I just wanted to tell you guys, this is called a single ladies meal. Fast one, but you have to, hold on. You have to, oh. we have to take care of ourselves. If we're alone, older, I'm an older lady, as you know, and you're alone and um, no one's there to take care of you or help you. Um, I could have a lot of help, but I am a very independent person unless I'm dying. Like the other day, my cousin Jen, she came over and got all my wash. I couldn't even get off the couch and um, washed it and folded it and brought it back to me all beautiful. You have to take care of yourself. So, and I have this little puppy who needs me. So I have to get strength and uh, I'm going to send after this video, I'm going to send you pictures of my meal before I eat it. 
So I, I think a couple days, so bear with me please, because I definitely, my first craft, I have decided what to do. I don't like to break promises, and I promised uh, Chris that I would paint her a red truck, but now the holidays are over, so I don't wanna make her a Christmas red truck. Tell me what you think of this. I am going to paint a red truck, but I'm going to figure out a way, go on Google and look up some pretty flowers that I can paint in the back of the red truck. How do you like that, Chris? That will be my first craft. I have the canvas, I have paint, I'm all ready to go. I'm gonna sketch it before I come on and uh, send it out to Chris. That's gonna be my first giveaway for this season, this new year. Um, so hang in there and please wait for me. I am feeling a little stronger and maybe with this nice meal, I'll feel even better. So this next video, I'll, show, I'll have pictures, okay? So just remember, you gotta take care of yourself no matter how tough it is. God bless. Take care.